everybody welcome back to my channel happy saturday october 17th hopefully that's right i think it is and i wanted to share with you guys my breakfast but unfortunately i was so hungry i already cooked it ate it and everything i do have a clip of my acai bowl that i got from walmart it was a few bucks it was so so good I also want to share for today's video, as you can tell by the title, is my budgeting video for October 20th budget plan. The first category is rent, and that's going to be $280. That's half of our rent amount for one month. I do half, my husband does half, and that's how we pay our rent ahead of time. It is pretty affordable compared to a lot of other people's rent amounts and mortgages. We have groceries, that's going to get $150. My husband and I have talked about this a lot, and we want to come up with an emergency food medical and toiletries supply because obviously we don't know what's in store in the future and we want to make sure that we are prepared and then Naviant is going to get $200 and that is the minimum payment that I'm going to throw towards student loan number two phones is going to be $102 gym membership I left it blank because the thing is with gym membership and personal training I need to call them and tell them that I'm going to cancel my membership and it is kind of sad but I've been telling myself that it is the kick in the right direction that I need in order to save money and also I want to work out from home so I feel like I am ready to do that and I want to tackle on my own workouts at home, watch some videos and be motivated and determined in that way because it's honestly money that I'm spending and I am not going to the gym right now so it is a waste of money and it could go to something else. Taxes is going to get $100, new phone, okay so this category I have it in here because, yes, I purchased my new phone. Yes, I purchased the cases. And I actually still haven't purchased the screen protector. However, guys, however, this is the thing. I don't know how much they're going to charge me to switch and to um, program that other new phone, the Samsung Galaxy S10e, to Metro PCS. So I want to make sure that I have a nice buffer in there just in case because I know that they were going to charge me, but I can't remember how much. Laundry is going to get $10 because I already have $30 in there that I have not used from the last laundry stuffing, and that's because my husband actually purchased the detergents and did the washing and drying himself, so I saved me money. Work slash gifts is a new sinking fund, and the reason why I'm categorizing and actually making this a sinking fund a part of my life right now is because obviously potlucks happen at work, and gift exchanges happen at work, and people leave and people come, so you give goodbye gifts and hello gifts and all sorts of stuff that people want to pitch you in for. So I want to make sure that I have money to do so instead of saying no. Even though saying no is an option, I do want to partake in some of the activities. And I do have two categories that are budgeted for $25 each. I don't want to include those uh, names because some of my family members actually watch my videos. Hey, shout out to the ones that do. I love y'all. And I want to make sure that they don't see the amounts and also the names. So that's why. But it is two $25 amounts under there. What I need for this paycheck period, which is being covered by the pink slip for my cash breakdown, is $992 for this paycheck period. And I, like I said, do foresee seeing my family next weekend. So we were talking about budget-friendly ways to uh, celebrate and enjoy our company together and we thought about having a picnic which would be an awesome amazing opportunity on a low low cost so who doesn't love sandwiches and we're still spending quality time with each other so hopefully 
my family will enjoy that and I will too. If you enjoyed my video, please give me a huge thumbs up. It really helps my YouTube channel out. Consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. What are you waiting for? It's free. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Have a very happy, happy Saturday. Don't forget to check out my description box for all the goods. And until tomorrow, guys, bye.